The stars will align for you, but first you must say thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, universe for another day. Look, I know a lot of people are going through it right now. I got a long ass message, Deep Divers, from a fellow Deep Diver who's like, Ralph, I'm depressed as fuck. <laughs> right now it's hard, very hard. I've lost my purpose. I live with my parents who are bots. And it's getting really hard. It seems like I'm living in a world full of zombies. People who don't think for themselves and I'm here and I feel all alone. Hold it right there. Hold it, hold it, hold it, hold it. That was me like when I first started my journey, Deep Divers. I'm going to help you out. We got a whole lot to talk about how to survive the zombie apocalypse right now. <laughs> Let me send you some good ass energy. Take that, take that, take that. Raising the frequency. I woke up today and I started to raising the vibration. <laughs> you hear that bird deep divers? We're in the heart of nature. Beautiful day. Let me just woo, breathe in that good ass prana, baby. Let me just peace, infinite waters, diving deep once again. Beautiful deep divers. We are out here in the heart of nature, baby. Give thanks, give thanks, give thanks. Now, a lot of people are around other people who are zombies, bots, people who are so plugged into the matrix and sometimes we can all feel alone. Here to remind you deep divers, if you feel like you don't belong in this world, that's because you came here to create a new one. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. Look, right now, with everything that's happening on the planet, you have two sides. And I told you, for a war to begin, there has to be two sides. And right now, a lot of people are having big arguments with people they know, friends, family members, because some people are wanting to be free and standing in their power, and some people don't mind being automatons. And growing up, my mom was very open-minded to me, but other relatives were like trying to pull me into the matrix, so I know exactly how you feel. And sometimes it's those closest to you that can hurt you the most. Sometimes we wonder, like, where are our soul tribe? How come I'm living in a place and nobody gets me? I'm just surrounded by zombies. Now, I told you, deep divers, with this global pandemic, in this matrix, the inorganic ones employ these celebrities who are going to force you to take the sh They're going to force you to take the shots, right? And you saw with the... Vax live concert, Prince Harry out there saying a whole lot and J-Lo, all of these celebrities like saying, hey, just get with a script, stick with a script, get with a program. And this is exactly, this is exactly what happens when we talk about zombies and bots because they try and force us into their world, which is a world of slavery. And we just want to be free. Can we just be free? Yes, you can. And we ain't even had breakfast yet. Can I get a hello there? How to survive the zombie apocalypse right now. I want to remind you, you're not crazy. You're just waking up. I want to remind you, many people we know and love are slowly turning into zombies, are slowly becoming bots. And sometimes it can be alienating. Sometimes living in this world can be alienating because we we're like, oh my gosh, I'm lost. I feel depressed. I don't know my purpose. But this is all because this system was designed to keep you in a low frequency and a low vibration. Here to remind you, if you have parents who don't get you, friends who don't get you, a whole world that doesn't get you because you're like, hey, we ain't having it. I want to be free. First of all, remind yourself it's not personal, deep divers. It's not personal. It's not personal. 
I got a sister, Deep Divers, and I don't like talk to her about awakening all the time because I'm like, hey, you live your life, I'll live my life. It's not personal. Even with your parents, it's not personal. They're from a different generation. Even if, even if you have strangers right now that you meet and they're like, hey, you're crazy. Or hey, just get with a program. It's not personal. Even if you have people trying to force you to take the shots, it's not personal. You see, when you realize that everybody in this matrix has been programmed, your entire life has been a lie. What's happening is that you are now awakening from the deep sleep that you were put in. And you're like, actually, I need to get out. Celebrate. Celebrate. Freedom is a gift, which many people don't find in their lifetime. You have found it and it's not easy. It's birth pains right now. It's the metamorphosis. I want you to remind yourself you are never alone. I want you to remind yourself you are already that being. All you have to do is move into that place. I want you to remind yourself the moment I started to do what I love every single day, which is to woo, breathe in that good ass prana, baby. The stars started to align for me. I'm not here trying to save the world. I'm here to have fun doing a little samba, baby. You're not here to tell people how to live their life, to save people, to convince people. You are only here to live your truth. The truth can't be told. It can only be realized. Always remind yourself of that. The truth can never be told. It can only be realized. Most people won't get you. Why? Because they are programmed. And the only way to break out of the program is to detach. That's the only way. When you speak some truth and everyone gives you that fluoride stare. It's happened to me, but I want to remind you. Your soul tribe is out there. You got to focus on you right now. You got to remind yourself that, look, not everyone's going to make it and not everyone can go. There are levels to this and everyone also awakens at a different time. Certain friends, you know, family members, they're still plugged into the matrix. They haven't awakened yet. You have and you're young. You're an old soul coming back, remembering who you are, remembering who you are, that actually this is all an illusion. It's all a stage show. Congratulations. But you might be the odd one out because most people are so under the spell. And that's why I told you, when you say good morning to someone, you put them into a spell. Morning, who's died around here? Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. This entire matrix was designed to keep you as a zombie and the only way to survive the zombie apocalypse is to have a mind of your own is to be courageous is to have bravery is to realize this too shall pass one day soon enough you will be with your soul tribe you'll give them a big fat hug you will be with people who accept you for you who love you for you who get you but right now you got to realize that life is all about the contrast you see it takes being in the wrong environment to appreciate when you're in the right environment, right? I had to be around people who didn't get me to actually really appreciate this beautiful community with infinite waters. It happens to the best of us. If you are around bots, throw them some compassion, send them some love and compassion because most people lack self-awareness. You are becoming self-aware and that's a gift, but it's not easy because the more your eyes open, the more you realize everything out there is a big illusion. Most people don't question, they don't think you're doing that. But I'm here to remind you, you don't have to carry all of this load by yourself. You're not here to solve the problem of life. You're here to experience the beauty of life. Mm. What? Slow motion this side. Mm. I know, right? We live in a world so fake, the truth actually scares people. 
We live in a world where people will protest about sports games, but won't protest for their freedom. I know it's kind of annoying, but remind yourself, if you want to change the world, you got to be an example. If you want to change bots and deal, if you're dealing with bot prep, bot parents, friends who don't get you, strangers who don't get you, be the example, be the lighthouse, show them that how you can live will work. And this is why you have to turn off their world and turn on your world and create your own reality and step into radical action to start living the life you know you came here to live and realize, be the example of the world you wish to live in. They're not the problem. Right now it's on you, you gotta take responsibility. Instead of thinking about, hey, let me change the world from the outside in, it's never gonna work. No matter how mad you are at the media, politicians, the government, your parents, bots, they're not gonna change. All you can do is focus on yourself and change. You see, real change happens from the inside out. Seven day vegan challenge. I wake up every single day with a whole bunch of grapes in my mouth. Make sure you're eating the papaya, the guava, the watermelon, the mangoes. Feel good within you and your outside reality will change for the better. You will be steered into your purpose. As soon as I had a whole bunch of grapes, I'm, I'm like, okay, this is what I'm here to do. But if you, are, if you are eating junk, it's no wonder why you're feeling like junk and like depressed and you have no purpose because you are what you eat. So remind yourself every single day, your story is not over and you're not here to go out like this. But these people in your life, bots, bot parents, friends who don't get you, giving you the fluoride stares, strangers who don't get you, a system that doesn't get you, they are designed to help you evolve. Be thankful for that. They are also designed to show you that there are levels to this. The higher you go up the pyramid, the smaller the ratio. The higher you go up the pyramid, the smaller the ratio. There are, there are fewer people there at the top who really get it. The masses are at the bottom, programmed by TikTok, Instagram, fluoride stares, the media that lies to you every single day, the masses worshipping celebrities, forgetting they are the real stars. So remind yourself, it will get better for you. The stars are aligning for you, but first you must say thank you. And first you must remind yourself, you didn't come here to change the world. You came here to realize you are the world. And as you change from the inside out, the world around you will change. And then you'll just say, feel so good to be alive, baby. Can I get a hello? <laughs> Deep divers, I'm just, woo, breathing in that good ass prana, baby. Raising the frequency raising the vibration. Take that, take that, take that. Good ass energy I'm sending you. Shout out to everyone who's been getting the wonderful good ass prana shirts at ralphsmart.com slash clothes and spreadshirt.com if you're in America. And if you're a sexy ass model, woo! With a whole lot of heart surviving the zombie apocalypse, you want to model the clothing? Well, go and buy some. Let me know why you have what it takes to model the clothing, okay? Add me on Instagram, Deep Divers, for more daily inspiration at official Ralph Smart at Infinite Waters and Facebook at Ralph Smart at Infinite Waters and Snapchat at Good Ass Prana. Pardon, at Good Ass Prana, baby. Check out the new book, Deep Divers, for more powerful, life changing information just like this. Feel Alive by Ralph Smart on Amazon and at ralphsmart.com slash the book. The truth can't be told. It can only be realized. Mm. Slow motion this side. Mm. Continue to live your truth and your reflections will find you. Have a beautiful day, deep divers. Peace. Infinite waters diving deep once again. Stay well. Stay healthy. Peace. You. They tried to bury us. They forgot we were seeds. They tried to put pressure on us. They forgot. We came here to shine bright like a diamond. We are diamonds, deep divers. This is alchemy right now. You turn the negative to the positive. You turn the fluoride stairs to the beautiful smiles. Have a beautiful day. Peace.